Hi guys, the other day while doing some archival digging, I found some interesting newsreel footage of early Cold War British missiles. The footage features the Malkara anti-tank missile and the Thunderbird surface-to-air missile. The Malkara was developed in the early 1950s. It was a wire-guided anti-tank weapon with a 57-pound Hesh warhead. It had a range of up to 2.5 miles and in the footage we see it guided through a small hole in a target net. Britain reveals its newest missile, an anti-tank weapon with accuracy measured in inches. That one nicked the target. Try again. The Malkara was mounted on a number of platforms and vehicles and remained in service into the mid-60s. Its bulk and weight saw it replaced by the smaller Vickers Vigilant and the Swingfire. Another new missile, the massive Thunderbird with four rocket boosters to help it aloft. Self-guiding once in flight, it's designed to knock out enemy missiles. The second missile featured in the newsreel is the English Electric Thunderbird, a British Army surface-to-air missile with a 75km range and a speed of Mach 2.7. The Thunderbird was replaced by the Rapier in the 1970s, which is still in service today. Hope you enjoyed seeing some of these British Cold War missiles in action. It's amazing what you can find in the archives when you aren't even looking for it. Don't forget to like, share and subscribe. Thanks again for watching.